Hello everyone, my name is Mark and my name is Elver. Today's video we will be showing you how to film your piano performance. Okay, we have two tripods here. Uh, this is a tripod that I will use on the upper part for the upper view. Okay, this is just a regular tripod for holding your camera. We will use this printer cable and if you're using an Android device, we have Type-C OTG and if you're using an iPhone, we have Lightning Connection Kit and this is just a regular printer cable so you can connect your uh, keyboard to your MacBook. So we will use uh, Contact Virtual Instrument for your piano sounds. Here in our location, we will set up the instruments and the gadgets that we will use. And this will be the setup. We will install the camera on this uh, tripod, the overhead tripod for the upper view of your keyboard, like this. So you can adjust also and adjusting for best angle. Okay, we're looking for the best spot on where we will put our camera. To power our keyboard, we will need this jack pin, uh, 12 volts on our car. So we will connect it to our car's battery and then we will install it on the keyboard depends on your keyboard so you need to check the wire if it's compatible so next is we will connect the USB cable the printer cable to our MacBook so our MacBook is running the battery so we don't need to plug the MacBook because it has a battery so it will send MIDI data. While playing, the sound of the keyboard will go directly to the MacBook. We are recording MIDI here. So afterwards, we can edit the MIDI data in the studio. We're recording some video clips here. So after we finish recording the video, we will sync the audio on the laptop using the tripod uh, we can record the top view after we record the clips and it's time to go to the studio and edit the videos here I will edit the MIDI data that I record on the field I'm using a virtual instrument, contact, and we will edit the MIDI data and fix some bad notes. I'm using Logic here, Logic Pro, because it's very, very easy to navigate and easy to use. After you edit the notes and uh, add some effects, it's time to bounce the audio into mp3 for fast video editing i will use video guru app i will edit the video on the phone for fast editing and this is the video clips i will check the video clips that i will use and after it i will sync the audio the mp mp3 audio from my laptop i will send it to the phone and sync it here so this is my process on how I make my music video. Thank you very much guys for watching and subscribe to the channel if you haven't subscribed for more keyboard tips and tricks.